Hey folks, Nice Triada Plaza in Mount Carmel, Illinois. Today we got a 2006 Chevy Silverado LT 4x4. It's got the 5.3 V8. Uh, it's got 214,000 miles on it. It does have a clean Carfax. Take you on a virtual tour, show you the imperfections of the vehicle. I start with the front end here. I kind of have rock chips across the front. There's a little, little ding right here. A few rock chips here and there. Uh, top of the hood looks pretty good. Looks like maybe a little bit of actually tree sap looks like right there. Headlights look, look pretty good. The lowers look like they have a little um, condensation in them. The front bumper has been pushed down, looks like on this side. So it has been pushed down a little bit there. Tires are probably 30%. Uh, there is, is some pitting on the uh, rims. Uh, it does have the tow haul uh, mirrors. I do have a little scratch there. You have some rocker rust across the bottom. Common on this uh, old Chevy's. This truck has been in uh, Mount Carmel its whole life. Coming down the side here, there's some scratches here. It does have the uh, track uh, track rack system in it. Uh, you can this you can move this and it'll move wherever you want. Uh, it's all aluminum. And it does have a really nice toolbox in this thing too. Tire is probably 30 percent. We do have the rust and a little bitty hole right there forming. Coming around the back side you do have some rust in the bumper on each side. You do have a uh, tow package on it. Uh, you are missing this little trim piece. They're usually all of them fall off and everything opens as it should. Rubber mat. Come around the side here, we do have a small dent there. 30% at least. Coming down here, we do have some cab corner issues going on along with the rockers. Normal, uh, normal Chevy stuff going on, guys. Coming on up the other side, you do have a little scratch on the mirror. Um, we do some scratches here. Show you this side first. This is the LT. It has the leather. Um, everything works in this truck. I think, I believe, except for that mirror over there. I'll show you here in a minute. Uh, it does have the heated seats. Uh, you got your Bose system in it. Let's see if we have any books. Yes, we do have books. Um, power seats over here. Work as they should. The back part works as it should also. Clean interior, back seat, I don't think anybody's even sat in it before. Uh, really good condition. Uh, no odors whatsoever. Uh, pretty clean truck, really. This is a consignment truck. This is not our truck. I'm selling it for, uh, actually he was a teacher here at the high school for many, many years. Actually, he's got three of these trucks. This uh, right here is broken, but the, you can see right here is the handles right here, so you just do like that. Like said, guys, very clean. We do have a blemish over here on the driver's seat, but that is it. Uh, for this many miles and the condition, everything, it's actually in really good condition. Uh, a little bit of, of here, but this leather is actually very soft and supple, so I don't see it actually tearing unless you actually get on it and really tear it. Well, the, the driver's seat works as it should. It has auto memory. The back works as it should also. Um, like I said, we have your heated seats, your auto memory one and two. Um, all the windows and everything work. When you get in this thing, the seat will move. As you do it, we'll do a startup. O 
Odometer says 214.603 currently on the miles. Uh, there are no check engine lights or anything like that. There is an airbag light on. Uh, that light right there is my seatbelt light. Don't have a seatbelt. No check engine lights or anything like that. Um, I drove this thing uh, probably 20 miles. It drives great. I mean, uh, actually drives really good. No shimmy in the brakes, anything like that. Uh, I shifted it into four-wheel drive earlier. It goes right in, I mean, immediately. Um, I'll do a rev test for you real quick. Great throttle response. Um, like I said, it does have the Bose system in it. Um, I'll check the windows first to show you they do work. Looks like they do have the auto function on both of them. Yeah, auto function does work as it should too. That one also. Now I checked the mirrors on the test drive. I couldn't get uh, this one here to, it tries to work. It's working somewhat. Uh, but the other one on this side, it did work. Um, I think, I do believe these mirrors will slide out on each side for trailer tow. Um, I don't know if you can see it, but it does have the turn signal uh, in the mirrors also. Um, let's see, let's go to the volume button here, control your bows. Dollars in free bets when they place a one dollar. You can see everything works there. Uh, it does have cold AC, um, it does have the auto function here and everything like that. Um, like I said guys, it's pretty pretty hot today, so um, it's, it's, it's nice and cold. Coming down the center stack, you got your storage. Like I said guys, pretty clean truck. Both lights work. It does have the auto four-wheel drive function also. Uh, I'm trying to think of anything else I'm leaving out here, guys. Uh, like I said, it, I drove it. It drove great. No issues. Doesn't pull either either way or brakes don't shimmy, anything like that. So pretty good running truck. Like I said, guys, okay, it does have the bows. Um, like I said, guys, this is a consignment truck. There is no trades in this truck. It is a flat sale only. You will be buying it straight from the buyer. You are not buying it from through the dealership. Cap on this thing. We got an 06 um, Chevy 1500 4x4. It's got 214,000 miles on it. Uh, it's got the 5.3 V8. It's got a clean Carfax on it. it. Does have that ladder rack system. Uh, it's all aluminum. It is nice. Um, like I said, guys, like it drove out great. So uh, it, again, I want to say it is a consignment vehicle. There is no trades. You are buying it straight from the individual. So whatever price you guys agree upon is the actual price of the truck. So um, we're located at 800 West 9th Street, Mount Carmel, Illinois. Give us a call 618-450-2600 or visit us on the web. You can see the Carfax in the video. It's 9thStreetAutoPlaza.com. Again, 9thStreetAutoPlaza.com. I hope this helps your buying experience. Have a great